Hello everyone, I am Sai Chitanya. Welcome back to my channel Sai Tech. Today I am finally back with a display comparison between all these four smartphones starting with the Poco X3 and the MI Note 10 Lite. So this is a kind of a new phone for most of the users because it did not get launched in India but which has got very good advantages and it is a Realme X2 as well as you can see Realme X2 and it is a Honor 9X Pro as well as you can see your friends Honor 9X Pro and the reason why I selected this all uh, four smartphones because they do have the different kind of pattern panels and different advantages so first is the poco x3 which has a ips lcd panel and the mi note 10 Lite, which is uh, out of this four out of this four smartphone this is the best uh, display ever i have used for the budget mobile so which has a curved amoled panel so that is a very advantage for this mobile phone so uh, it's a big big biggest disappointment uh, that the phone is not getting launched in india so i did expect the phone to be getting launched in india which has very good uh, advantage of the display and here is the realme x2 which has the amoled panel so which is also very good as well realme x2 and the honor 9x pro honor 9x pro has the ltps ips lcd panel so there is a difference between the ips lcd panel and the ltps uh, ips lcd panel the ltps will be having the more uh, brightness and more saturated colors so that's a good advantage with the Honor smartphones which are having the LTPS panels. So right now I'll try to play the same video in all of the four smartphones. And in case if you want to know what wallpapers I'm using currently in all of the smartphones, try to check the links in description for a complete detailed playlist of wallpapers and smartphones as well. So let's get uh, back into this uh, display comparison. You can see your friends right now I'm playing the same video in all the four smartphones. So you can see the difference as well. So I have using the full brightness in all the four phones. As I said, the Honor 9X Pro has more brightness. So right now you can clearly see the brightness levels in the Honor 9X Pro. So after the AMOLED panels, I do like the LTPS IP, IPS LCD panels. So uh, the MI Note 10 Lite has very good advantage of having this uh, curved display, which is very good and compact size, 6.4 inches screen and very less weight as well, 203 uh, grams only. As you can see, friends, right now with the full brightness in all the four, all the four phones, as you can see, the curved edges. So for the mid-range segment mobile phone, this is the only phone which has a curved smartphone. So this is a very good price, friends. I think if you convert to the Indian uh, rupees, it will be close to twenty thousand rupees only for this curved display and the compact size. And it is the Realme uh, X2 as well. So both are kind of AMOLED panels and both they do look uh, very close to each other. So there is not much difference between both of the smartphones. So in the AMOLED panels, both phones are pretty good and the MI Note 10 Lite has advantage of having curved edges. And when it comes to the IPS LCD panel and LTPS panel, so you can see the difference, uh, slightly more brightness in the Honor 9X Pro device when you compare with the Poco X3. If you observe this kind of uh, bottom area, you can see the difference as well in terms of how darker in the Poco X3 and how much brighter here as well. This kind of small difference you can notice right now. And now let me try to uh, move away the studio lighting effect a little bit so you can actually see the difference clearly. As you can see, friends, this is with the less studio lighting effect. And now let me try to uh, decrease the brightness. I'm trying to decrease the brightness to number 5. As you can see, this is the brightness at number 5. And let me try to decrease the brightness to 0. And in zero brightness mode, all the four phones are pretty good. So that's a good advantage because when you're traveling at night and uh, if you want to watch a movie if, without disturbing the side passengers, then this phone will be very good advantage, all of these uh, four smartphones. So, but overall friends, uh, first position in, the, in terms of the saturation mode uh, goes to the 
obviously the top uh, AMOLED panels and next I'll be giving the points to the Honor 9X Pro device because it has got very good higher brightness levels and very good contrast and saturation levels when you compare with this uh, Poco X3. The Poco X3 has the advantage of having this uh, video toolbox so where you can change the colors but still even though I use the cinematic colors but still uh, I'm not able to get that kind of uh, uh, saturated colors in the Poco X3. So this is a quick uh, display comparison between all of the four smartphones. And for more details, make sure to follow me regularly. So there is a playlist available, links in description for each and every smartphone. And that's it for this video friends. See you in the next video. Until then, bye.